It's the Bisons. It's the Huskies. It's been 315 days since the Bisons came in here and lost in that Hardy Cup. They try and right the wrong tonight, and the Huskies look to move to 5-0 and for the sixth time in their program history. Ted Cabongo is going to take the opening kickoff on the right side. He's going to dance his way around the 30, out to the 40. Hurls the man. House call. 50, 40, 30, 20, 10, 5. See ya. Ted Cabongo starts your Friday night with a 100-yard return. Play action. Engel to the left side. He's going to sling it out to the far sideline, and that is going to be caught right near the 29-yard line. Jason Soriano in there with the grab there and that'll be a first down Nixon Bull in on the tackle at the end but not before another first down by UBC on the line, Engel's going to sling it out and a good looking catch by Edrin Williams there, diving to the sideline, a stole in coverage out to the 42 yard line a 7 yard strike and a first down pickup, quads to left side and Knight is going to be met right near the line of scrimmage there, they'll give him a yard and a half on forward progress to the 49 nine yard line but a couple of tacklers in the play including Carson Bell and that front seven standing up there on first down for a game of one first on the left hash mark angle pump fake angle pressure husky pack in the back and a sack there Thunderbirds moving left to right white buckets blue uniforms blue pants white letter number logo and trim quads right hand off this time tonight and they Nothing but green, 40, 30, 20, 10, 5, foot race, touchdown Isaiah Knight, 54 yards to the house, and the Thunderbirds reclaim the lead. Second and seven, trips left, he looks left, goes to his right, second read, finds Weeb, and Weeb sure-handed gets spun around to the 42-yard line. Three Thunderbirds in on the tackle. First one to get to him, Kijon Johnson. We're on trade 30 to go here in the first quarter at Griffith Stadium. Huskies moving left to right on first down. Nice is going to sling that out to the boundary side and catching that on the play, Daniel Perry. Eight yard gain out towards the 18 yard line will bring up second and two. two. Derek Engel got a man up in the air and he's going to duck his head forward. He's going to pick up close to eight right down the middle of the field out to the 43 yard line he got the defensive lineman up in the air on that play and Lane Novak with the cleanup at the end chasing him from behind this one over the middle is Williams with a sure handed grab down to the 52 yard line on the right hash mark and prove us both wrong Derek Engel a strike through the heart of that defense picks up a key first down with 201 to go here in the first on a first down a hand out to Isaiah Knight he's going to get met in the backfield, John Stoll there in on the initial tackle. That'll be about a one-yard loss to the 54-yard line on the right hash mark. Brings up second and 11. And off the shotgun, Nye nice steps into the middle. He's going to sling one deep down the field. Weeb catches it inside the 30, 20, 10, 5. House call. Touchdown, Huskies. Uh, trips left to the right, one offset. Knight, who's going to slip it out of the backfield, and he's going to give it to Knight. A little behind him, but Isaiah Knight's going to make one miss. He's going to pick up close to 13, down to the 39 and a half yard line on that right hash mark. Burt to the left side, fights Knight on a delayed screen, and Knight catches it. 30, 20, 10 breaks the tackle, 5 into the end zone. Touchdown, Thunderbirds. A 45 yard screen out to the right side. And Isaiah Knight gets a UBC Thunderbirds off and soaring here early on in the first quarter here on your Saturday afternoon. Under the gun there, and he's going to heave it up towards the end zone. And that is going to be fumbled around and incomplete and pass interference on the defense. Ringland was in coverage, went up for it against Mims, and they'll spot that ball at the one-yard line and a fresh set of downs with shock. And the front seven is going to get tested, and Riker Frank is going to break a couple tackles. Down out to the Rams' 14-9-yard line, a pickup of 13 and a first down. Round Engel out of the RPO action. He's going to sling it and Ringland in the, on the tackle, but not before securing it near the 15-yard line. Edron Williams, another first down, and with 104 and counting, UBC continues to plunge forward. On first down, a hand out to Isaiah Knight. He's going to get met 
in the backfield. John stole there in on the initial tackle. That'll be about a one-yard loss to the 54-yard line on the right hash mark. Brings up second and left. Yeah, John. Down angle to the far sideline to Edron Williams, and he's going to get wrapped up out of bounds. He's going to get 12 in the first down. Charlie Ringland throwing him out there near the 41-yard. Mariano goes back. Interception, Nixon full. At the 52-yard line, and he's going to keep returning this one inside the 28-yard line. Back-to-back throws, back-to-back interceptions by the defense. And to the right, and looks like moving out of the backfield was Deshaun Mims, who goes back to the left slot position, and it's a handoff. And he is going to be, Katunde is going to be knocked in the backfield. Meeting him first there with a pop was George Adako. And then cleaning up at the end there was Weeb and company. Brings up second and ten on that right hash mark. Weeb isolated to the right side, trips to the left, Perry to the right slot. Nice, looks left side, he looks over the middle of the hash mark. Stretching out, catching it, touchdown, Huskies! What a grab! And a touchdown strike, hauling it in, Caleb Morin! Nice, shotgun, Kabongo on the backfield, fake handoff, he's going to find his men, and Vavra there. He's going to make one man miss, stiff arm with the right hand. He's going to size up a second. He's going to get chopped up out of bounds at the 42-yard line. Coming in there to dive and make the nose tackle at the end of there, Maxwell Kennedy. And they will be on that right hash mark. Trips to left, two to the right, Frank in the backfield. A little RPO action over in the middle. He finds Ted Kabongo. Kabongo's going to advance to the 25. And he's going to get chop blocked at the end there by Marcos Bakru in a dangerous looking tackle. But Kabongo gets up no worse for wear. Snap good, hold good, kick up right footed boot. That is up and that is true. And a trio added to the scoreboard for the visitors. 21-19, 33 seconds to go. Here in the first half, you're listening to Huskies football on the Husky Fan Radio Network, the Husky Fan app, and huskyfan.ca. Two to the left, trips to right, left hash mark, shotgun, Miller stands in to block. Nice, over the mail for Weeb, and that's contested, and that is broken up. He tried to high point that one and catch it in the end zone. Zach Herzog with the strip with the right hand there at the top of that route, right by the goal post, will bring up second and ten. Off the fake RPO, he's going to find his man. He's going to pick up a first down close to 14 on the play. Ak Gasma on the boundary side. They'll mark that at the Huskies' 48-yard line and bring up a fresh set of down. Nias will have trips to his right, two to the left, one Frank to his offset left side in the shotgun formation. He's going to look to the left side, dump it over the middle of Frank, and Frank's going to stiff arm one man. He's going to get chopped up at the end there by the linebacker in the play on Ryder Varga, who we mentioned at the top of the broadcast, and he'll mark him about... A half yard short right by the 42-yard line on that left hash mark. Brings up third and one. Tavar pistol formation in the backfield, and Pelche is going to hand it off to him. And he's going to get wrapped up by that left hash mark. After about a yard and a half, two-yard gain, John stole the defense back in on the tackle. Eight carries for 40 yards so far, officially on the stash sheet. 320 to go here in the first half, first and ten. RPO, and it's a handoff to Frank right down the middle of the field. Nothing but nylon into the end zone. House call. Touchdown, Huskies. Riker Frank breaks contained down the middle of the field. The seas opened up 20 yards into the end zone. And guess what? The Huskies are back in business and have the lead here at Griffith Stadium. Galvin Fields at the 38-yard line. Right foot of boot angle to the left side. And again inside the 20. Weeb's going to field that backtrack into the 15-yard line. And he's going to make a couple men miss. And the ball's popped out. And who's got it on the ground? A pile up. And the officials are going to have to discuss this. And it looks like the Huskies are going to recover. Pelche in the shotgun with Katende to his left. It's going to be RPO action. And he's going to call his number. And he's going to plunge into the end zone on his own two feet. A one-yard touchdown by Noah Pelche. And while they're back in business here, folks, this game isn't over yet as the Rams inch closer. First down, trips to the left. Pelche is going to swing, and that's going to be picked off. Ball game, Huskies. Interception being hit out of bounds at the 50 of the Rams. and sealing the deal. John Stoll steals the show here to cap off your Saturday afternoon. The woes of a first-year quarterback. And the storybook ending all for naught as the Huskies are going to sweep the season series. Bongo lines up to the left as he gets the handoff here again. He's going to make one man miss, two man miss, three, house call, 30, 20, 10, 5, touchdown Huskies. A 47-yard scamper into the end zone. You can put this game to rest, baby.